So I'm gonna be doing one more case, and that is the class of the Titans. I don't know, the last one was a bit short. I don't know, maybe it's just me. Our high school, oh, high school reunion. Oh, yeah, that was it, right? They were supposed to go to the high school reunion when they were in Ireland, right? I think. Yay. This should be fun. I don't really like this. Like, it's so dark. I'm like looking at the picture. The square. Maybe. I don't work on that. Oh. Just like McKing, eh? No, not like McKing. Well, sort of like McKing. The same but different, you know? <laughs> yeah, I gotcha. Cool. He inspired you. You followed him into the force and now work under him, right? Like a mentee. Am I picking you up correctly? I want to go now, Dooley. <laughs> you wore your uniform? How else will people know about my side gig as a private dancer? Gotta get those clients somehow. Wait, so his side gig is a private dancer now? Jesus. I was inspired by Detective McKing too, you know. I'm going to regret asking this, but inspired to do what? To stalk him and build a shrine, of course. I even dyed my hair to the same color as his wife. That bit, uh, yep, full of regret. <laughs> okay, I hope this works, guys. I really hope this the picturing works. Look, I look dark. I don't know. I gotta work on that. Anyway, I run an adult store now. What the hell? Yeah, exactly like that. And we pride ourselves on stalking it all. Old, young men. Okay, I'm not gonna even read that. Every kind of grown-up you could want to hang out with. Oh, a store for renting actual adults. Phew, which does not make it any better, but okay. That's the one. You can rent them by the hour, day, week, long, or even purchase an adult. But you have to pass a background check, of course. We can't just go letting adults out of the wild unsupervised. Okay, I, it still doesn't make sense to me. Oh, one minute, detective. I still haven't handed everybody here a business card. Never mind. Okay, I guess I guess I have to talk to everyone. I don't know. Professor Time Loop, I haven't seen you in years. You look exactly the same. What even is time? But seriously, it's only been what two years, three? Uh, something like that. Maybe a little longer, a smidge. I've never been good at reading pay ages. It's the lack of facial features. Whoa, whoa. What was that? Gas? You think the entire building shook from somebody passing gas. Collective gas. <laughs> Enough to rock an entire building? Maybe. Well, just in case it's not gas. Just in case, mind you. We should get up to the roof and look around, see if we can spot anything strange. I hope that wasn't some tectonic plates action caused by drilling from an underwater sit. Ooh, damn, okay. Stirring is usually good for stock. I should check the market. Alright, let's go here. We should get to the roof and see what is- oh, okay, fine. Whoa. There it is again. This just in. The sky is falling. He's part of the reunion? Sorry, pictures are for graduates only. But we are graduates. Likely story. Can't get in. Oh, there's stairs. Whatever is happening, I give it a thumbs down. Okay. That's normal, right? A normal thing that's happening. Yeah, that's right. Normal. Do you know that the fire extinguisher used petrol? The principle was the same as with Angry Kid. Let it tire itself out. Not helping. Oh, we should get to the river and see what they're causing. Okay, let's go here. Do you see where that rumbling came from? Nope, not a thing. Oh! Okay, okay. The Chutlu. I think that's what it was called. What, what it's called? Yeah, Chutlu? Okay. That thing, maybe. Wait, I think I know him. What? You know him. Funny story. Flashback! <laughs> Alright, fella. You, uh, you okay? His name is Jeff. I'm not sure. I think I'm a little lost, maybe. 
happens to the best of us. Why don't you come with me and we'll see if we can get you home? Okay. Dry your eyes, Patrick. That buzz sounds like a real jerk. You like it here, just like home, but even better, less nagging, am I right? Glad we're agreed you don't need to go back there anytime soon. There he is. Did you order anything out? Uh, yet? Sorry. Ha, where are my manners? Everyone, this is my pet, Patrick. We're gonna be best of friends. What the fuck? Uh, I already have a best friend. Oh goodness, it talks. It never said it talked. It talks back more like. Haha, <laughs> Patrick, so help me. What did you help that clumsy jerk for? Uh, I'm a cop. Means 5% of my job is helping. Lame. Come on, let's go do some of that exercise stuff you're always on about. I want to buff up so I can push over some old ladies. Uh, oh, come on. It will help your friend find us. How exactly? He's a cop too, right? Stupid do-gooder. We'll probably investigate or something. Let's talk in more granny tipping. You want your friend to find you, right? I do. Let's go then, loser. I don't like him. He's so mean. You okay, Jeff? I heard the barbells drop from the screaming boy that it is that is the toilet. Huh? From the screaming boy that is the toilet? Okay. He's okay. Say, is that a police uniform? It is. A dancer's uniform. For dancing. I guess that's not wrong. Why do you ask? Need some NYP Dell toys for an event? Nah, I think I need to go home, Patrick. I pulled all my muscles. Every last one. Can you massage them better? Oh, wait. He's the guy who, um... Dude, he's messed up. He's an asshole. Here again? Ugh, come on, Patrick, move on. Your friend has. It's been a year. He probably didn't even try looking for you. If he's as good a detective as you keep saying, he found you by now, right? Maybe? I think it's time we accept this as your life now. I. Maybe you're right. Oh, okay. Hello? Dooley! D Detective, is that you? Yes, Dooley, it's me. Not long after that, I was teleported back. I guess Jeff came to send me off, or maybe I left something behind? Well, that's that, then. Let's go back to the party! That is not that, Dooley. This thing is here to find you, and it's going to tear the city apart to do it. Just as well we're not in the city, then, isn't it? You're right, we're not. And if we lure that thing out here, it won't be either. Yeah, but then it'd be near... Oh man. We need to find a way to call out to the creature. Show it that you're here so it leaves the city alone. And then? Uh, one step at a time, eh? He's such a jerk though. Oh, okay. He sounds like a jerk. I don't like Jeff. Hmm, maybe we can use the sport fields. Jump Bortron and speakers to call out to him. Lure him here? We should probably go check out the control room. Uh. Seriously? You actually took refuse sacks? Oh, come on, dude. Is there more? Okay. Oh! What the hell? Why is he here? Hey now! I don't believe in pets. The entire concept, just don't believe it, happens. Humans owning animals. You ever see it? It's like gremlins or Santa Claus. I have a pet. You met her. You have also met gremlins and Santa Claus. McKean clamped him, remember? I remember upholding the law like a super, clock, a super cop working Christmas Eve. Who does that? This guy. Stay safe. TL. What's this? Looks like a door detective. I knew that. I was being retort- But you asked what it was. It's a door. I know, Julie. I wasn't really as a secret one without a handle. I can see all that. Looking through the keyhole, it seems to lead into the control room. Honestly, detective, I didn't know- I don't know how you get by without me mentoring you. Thanks, buddy. Anytime, detective, except when it doesn't suit. Where am I going to get a door handle? 
Oh, that time we put on the MC Escher play, we had a lot of old doors. I wonder if any of them are still backstage behind the gym. Okay. Baby. Let's see, where is the gym? Doors gym, here it is. Ooh. Now that it's empty, is it just a box? Does it know it's not fulfilling its purpose? Does the lack of tools upset it? Or is its two box status only something forced on it by humans? Maybe it's free to follow streams, whether there be field with flowers, children's toys, or just to lay idly empty and bask in the evening sun. I guess we'll never know. Anyway, back to the case. <laughs> oh, this will work. Nice. trying to see if there's a way I can go into the gym, but... Wait, you were? Yeah, I was out when I was dating a teacher. Wait, what? You dated a teacher? That's wrong in so on so many levels. Tell me about it. It was for biology. I had to get a teacher's cells and date how old, date how old they were. It was a right kerfuffle? I'm not gonna even ask. Still cold and nuclear hot. In case of emergency, hide in here. Bold children inside, please do not release. There are sandwiches, soups, cakes, yogurts, milk, and more in here. Thank goodness I'm starving, let's eat. Sorry buddy, everything is protected by the law of the label. I know, if there's a name, then that's a shame. Even I wouldn't break the first amendment of the constitution. <laughs> Oh wait, the milk hasn't got a name. Let's take it. It's the old west when it comes to unclaimed fridge items. Nice. Uh, the school's fuse box. The source of all power in this place. No, oh, everyone knows the principal is the source of all power here. The cover is off. We're on the road to mischief. If we want onto the stage, we'll need to cut the power first and get rid of the band. I know they weren't great, Detective, but driving them off stage seems a little harsh. Dooley, we need to get backstage and can't while they're playing. Whatever you gotta tell yourself, Detective. Yes. I feel bad ruining the entertainment, but needs must. Also, I think their lyrics were driving that man in the corner insane. How do I go back out oh, to the stage? Let's nip up now that the stage is free. It's like peering behind the curtain in Oz. Except these curtains are broken and don't open. Box of theater props. From fake food to skulls. Oh! Door handles! How handy! Huh? Handles? Handy? See? I don't get it. I give up. Oh, I see. Give up. Up because you can lift the handle up to open a door. Pretty clever, detective. Oh, oops. Oh, shit. I thought that was an actual door. <laughs> oh, I thought that was an actual door. Oops, okay. Uh, do I need this? We can save the world from just a tiny fraction of his singing. Great idea. I was gonna say we could start a band, but sure. Okay. Ropes, yes. The ropes that would... The ropes that would open the curtains that they weren't, as was mentioned, broken. A stack of various stage tapes could prove useful. I doubt a pile of tape can prove anything, detective. How would they gather evidence? By sticking to it? Contaminated. Oh, oopsie. Dude, I really thought that this was a door. <laughs> Did we check this one? 
Oh, our old yearbook. Don't make me be the don't we have a case to solve guy. Just one second. <gasps> Patrick Dooley, photo most likely to need rescuing from a sinister per parallel dimension. Haha, <laughs> as if. No, that actually did happen. Photo most likely to read the yearbook comments at our review. <laughs> Well... There's students? Aww... No, there's more. And buried in the backyard. Damn. But it's sort of cute still. Hmm. Hey, I didn't know he was... Voted most likely to be a normal human person? Huh. Most likely to put a fish in the percolator. Okay. We went to school with a lot of animals. The school had to make up class members to get federal grants. <laughs> in hindsight, we should have known this kid was different. I just thought they were a transfer student. From somewhere else? Okay. I don't know if we should start talking to everyone. Fern, long time no see. Hey, Francis, or is it detective now? Or they're friends, okay. Well, they don't make you give up your name or anything. Oh, right. Not parting with the others? Maybe in a bit. I'm just thinking the old art room in. Crazy to think this is where I spent most of high school. What are you at these days? I'm an animator nowadays. Going wherever the work takes me. Kind of ironic given I'm trapped in this low animation indie game. Oh, don't say that. I'm sure everything will work out for you. Shh. <laughs> oh, wait a minute. <laughs> Let's read this again. Hold on. Oh, dude, I am super slow today. That Maybe I shouldn't have started this case. <laughs> I'm trapped in this low animation indie game. It's this, in in it's this indie animation game that he's talking about. Duh. I'll catch you later, Fern. Thumbs up, Francis. Where did we? Does we see everything here? Sunglasses are cool. To right poster. Oh shit! Who knew he had sunglasses? I think I did this one. Did we try this one? An incomplete workshop pro project looks like a submergible. A submarine, you mean? Shh. We already had one of those. This is, this is different. Do you think they're trying to beat McKing's high school underwater record? I still cast suspicion on his diving record. Alright. This reminds me of my student days. Dooley, you still have refused sacks taped over your windows. Yeah, but then it was because I was poor. Now, now I do it because I have juicy secrets. Blackout blinds. Oh, so that's what it's for. Hey, Marv. Okay, Marv, this is gonna be easy. Just say something normal and start a conversation. You know you're saying all that out loud, right? Ah, Marv. God damn it. <laughs> Poor Marv. I like Marv actually. He's pretty funny, and he was helpful too. Guess I'm not. I can't go here, right? Why would you want to? I spent all of high school trying to stay out of that place. <laughs> Ooh, science lab. This is new. A lot of dangerous looking chemicals here. We should consume them to protect others. Or we can just take them for now. <laughs> Ooh, okay. We should be able to get to the door. <laughs> it's, mil it's milky. We should be able to get the door open with this. Hi, milky. I can't help but every time Milky comes, I don't know if this it happens to you guys too, but every time Milky comes, I want to pet her. <laughs> All right, the control room. This is good. Okay. Yeah, real good. 
We should unlock the other door into this place. Of course, being able to get back in will help with what comes next. You sure could enact a plan from here. One hell of a plan. You use all this audio-visual stuff to do it. Oh, obviously, every last piece of it. Do you know how to use this stuff? I can't even name most of it. <laughs> we might need to find some experts. <laughs> oh, Marv. Marv, you're a media kind of guy. I need some help. Need me to man a camera while you project an image of your friend here onto the big screen? All to lure a giant monster away from the city? And how the hell did he know that? How did you know? You know, you got the look. The luring monster away from the city look. It's in the eyes. I'll meet you out on the field. Now, who else was in the AV club? Uh, probably not Fern, but Fern! Uh, nope, okay. Let's try talking these to these people. Oh my god, Detective, that's Victoria the Weird and her school's. God damn, I can't read this. <laughs> what? Play it cool. Me? I'm a travel agent to the other side. The dark side? The dark. What? No, I'm an assassin. Oh, uh. <laughs> okay, that went well. Oh, 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 there's a room that we didn't see before. Ooh. Now, I think we need these. Alright. It's Mar Fern and... No way. McKing was in the AV club? Who? McKing, our mortal enemy. Old Dooley here doesn't have enemies. Whoever this McKing fella is, that's your beef. Okay. Fern. Um, I'm gonna talk to Fern. I'm pretty sure he's... Oh, yes! Okay. I never knew you were in the AV club with McKean. Ugh, don't remind me. Pretty sure he thought AV meant all viable options. Gross. Hey, so the, uh, city's under attack from a giant monster thing? This is why I came back from Tokyo. Work from home defense bunker days were getting all too common. Okay, not the response I was expecting. Look, I need help luring it away from the city. The word luring there suggests you're bringing it near to here, where we are, where I am, where I keep my organs. That is sadly the plan you in? Sure, this reunion blows anyway. Cool, meet me at the sports field. See you there. I gotta ask, ugh, my king for his help. But seriously, like, what, what will- Hi, Milky. What, what can the king do? Like, I don't, I don't understand. I talk to him. Hi, my king. Look, McKing, you're the last person I want to come for help. Then you must not like getting good help. You're an idiot is what I'm saying. Good one. Now, the city is in trouble, a gigantic thing is mashing the place, and I need help to get it here. Your help. A gigantic thing? Maybe you should be the one under the bleachers, smoking whatever cooking herbs you could find in the kitchen before you left home this evening? Okay, I'm pretty bored. What kind of help? I need your AV skills. I'm listening. I need you to control the stadium cameras and audio. We're putting on a show. Ugh. I may not like you, McQueen, but I swore an oath. The service oath? I know I swore it too. What? No, not not that junk. What kind of cop cares about that? I swore an oath to never leave any cable unplugged, any event unrecorded, and any request to for helping setting up the VCR unanswered. I'll see you dorks in the court control room. The service oath? Ha! Good one. That's all of them. I can hear to I can head to the control room now. What a view. Okay, this will let us connect the deck here to a mic out in the field. Oh, okay. Here? <laughs> Me too. It'd be better seeing for the singer if their backup mic was bust. I meant the plan. Oh yeah, me too. Okay, let's get to the control room and get this production up and running. This brings me back. How did you go from being an AV kid to being a detective? Ah, huh. I wanted to play a cop on TV, but I figured this was less work. Okay, we can figure this, figure this out. We just need to find a few things. We have everything. Let's do this. Out you go, Dooley. Oh man, if I don't come back from this, tell my wife I love her. Dooley, you're not married. She'll know what it means. 
Hey, it's me. Come over and say hi, terrible fiendish friend. Hmm, doesn't seem to be working. I don't think the creature can hear us. We couldn't hear it. We need to boost the volume somehow. Boost it? It's already at maximum levels. But what if it wasn't? But it is. Yes, but what if it wasn't? You're making no sense. Right now, this is at 10. If we can find a way to make it go to 11, it'd be louder. And how do we make it do that? You just write 11 next to 10. Jeez, this guy doesn't get it, does he? <laughs> the more you sense, the more you say, the less sense it makes. <laughs> well, unless you have a better plan. 